Hello, hello, and I'm almost Maddie. So this week I've got quite an interesting little issue lined up for everybody to listen to. This week I'm going to be talking about adults slash parents. I'm going to be categorizing, probably quite stereotypically, the types of adults slash parents there are in your lives. So yes, listen closely, come in, sit around the campfire, prepare yourself. So firstly, to begin this all, we just start with number one, the cool adult. So this adult's usually up to date with everything, tries to use the latest slang. Oh dude, you just got wrecked. Or get into conversations with your friends or anything like that. And sometimes some people don't pull it off very well. Yo Kitty Winks, you want to go to the school disco? It sounds pretty epic. Hashtag groovy, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> and use terms like hip and happening. You, you all know those type of adults. We all have one in our lives. So number two, the young adult. This is the type of person who has recently entered into adulthood, usually very young, and likes to use literally in every situation that they are now an adult. Don't be silly, I don't play video games anymore, I'm an adult. <laughs> no matter what situation it is, they will find a way to throw it in there. You know, we should totally go out for a coffee sometimes, because, you know, I'm an adult now. <laughs> Especially if they're probably a big sister or something like that, they will use it as an excuse. No, I think I should get to choose what's on the TV because I'm an adult now. Number three is the wise adult. This person is always the one you go to for answers no matter what it is about. You know this person will have the exact answer you need. Mummy, what's the meaning of life? Darling, it's simple. The answer to life is 42. They usually throw in like every now and then a metaphor or a deep and meaningful quote about life or something like that. Mommy, it's storming outside and I don't like it. It's alright darling, life is like a storm. At the end there's always a rainbow. They're usually just someone who is really smart and got the knowledge in the noggin. So yeah, we all know one of those. Number four, the back in my day adult. Now, without a doubt, everyone has one of these in their lives. Don't even joke, okay? Don't even, don't, don't you even tell me that you don't have one because there is one somewhere. Doesn't have to be your mum or your dad or anything. It's just, there's one adult somewhere that does this. No matter what the conversation is about, this person will always be able to relate what you're talking about back to themselves when they were younger. Mum, it's so unfair. I got so much homework today. Yes, well, back in my day, we got that much homework every day or say how it was harder for them back in their day. I cannot believe you did that. Back in my day, if I did that, I'd be hit with a cane. Number five is the guardian adult. Now this adult is usually very protective and won't let you go out anywhere or do anything without knowing blah 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 blah. Hey mum, I'm going to the movies, I'll be back later, okay? Wait, sweetie, before you go, how many people are going? How old are they? How many girls are going? How many boys are going? What are their names? Tell me all of them. What are their phone numbers? Where do they live? Yeah, they're very protective. They like knowing stuff. But yeah, everyone knows that can get annoying sometimes, but I say no more. Okay, number six, the free-spirited adult. Now this adult is usually like really arty and spiritual. They're always living in the moment and doing everything you wish you could do. Hey, I'm about to head out to go to the music and art festival. Do you guys want to come along? By the way, did I mention I'm riding my motorcycle there? In my opinion, they're usually the kind of person you wish you were like when you were older. They really do whatever they want and they're always wearing like really bright clothes and just being really out there. Finally, number seven, the life planning adult. Now this person usually has every single second of every single day planned out and scheduled. They usually are very organized and if they're a parent they usually put a lot of pressure on the kid, the, could be plural, about what you're gonna do when you're older, what are you gonna do with your life. So sweetie, what do you want to do with your life? I don't really know. Well I really think you should stop thinking about it, but I'm 11. What are your talents? What are you good at? Basically what I'm trying to say is what can you see yourself doing for the rest of your life? Uh, um. <laughs> and they just plan just everything so nothing is left to surprise. Maybe one or two things, but not much. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any of these type of parents or adults in your life, comment below and tell me which one they are and it shall be interesting to see. So I hope you guys have a good weekend and whoever you are and wherever you are, I hope you're happy and you're having fun. Bye.